Good morning, dear children. Now, today we will discuss the topic successor and predecessor. Okay, successor and predecessor. So, children, successor number just after and next number are same. Okay, only names are different, but the result is same. We get successor by adding 1. We get number just after, okay, by adding 1. And we get next number also by adding 1. We can see here, when we add a number with 1, we get the next number or successor or the number comes just after understood now see this example what comes after 220 okay what comes after 220 so we will add 1 to get the answer 220 plus 1 is equal to 221 so 221 comes after 220 understood and if the question will be what is the successor of 220 then again we will add 1 in 220 220 plus 1 is equal to 221 so here also we got the same answer so here 221 is the successor of 220. The number just after 599 is just after. Okay. Just after means we have to add 1 here. 599 plus 1 is equal to 600. So we can say 600 is the successor of 599. Nine. So, dear children, I hope you all have understood that successor number just after and next number are the same. And how we will get? By adding 1. Okay? Now, predecessor. Okay? Predecessor or number just before and previous number are same only names are different okay but the result which we get that is same by subtracting one we get the result now see here when we subtract one from a number we get its predecessor or we can say the number comes just before or the previous number okay now we'll see few examples here what comes just before 220 okay so what we have to do we have to subtract 1 from 222 to get the answer so 222 minus 1 is equal to 219 so 219 comes just before 220 okay now we'll see the next question also if the question will be asked like this what is the predecessor of 220 the same thing we will do we will subtract 1 from 220 okay and then we'll get 219 so 219 is the predecessor of 220 now children you all can see here 219 comes just before 220 and 219 is also a predecessor of 220 okay the number just before 776 is what we will do Again, we will subtract 1 
from 776 okay so we'll get 775 so 775 is the predecessor of 776 so children i hope you all have understood here also predecessor and the number just before and previous number are same and how we will get by subtracting one from the given number okay now turn page number 25 we will do exercise 2.2 .2. okay write the number that comes just before so we have to write here the numbers which comes just before this numeral okay so what we will do we will subtract it from 1 and then we will get here and the number is 143 and we will subtract it from 1 then what we will get 3 less 1 is equal to 2 4 and 1 means 142 here 801 what comes just before 801 800 here 776 what comes before 776 we will subtract it from 1 and then we will get the answer 775 okay what comes before 599 here will be 598 how we will subtract it from 1 then we will get here 9 less 1 8 here 9 and here 5 okay so these question you will do it by yourself question number 2 write the numbers that comes just after and here what we will do here we will add 1 okay we will add 1 and then we will get the answer 110 plus 1 then what we will get 1 1 and 1 111 800 plus 1 okay then only we will get the answer which comes just after 800 so it will be 801 okay 534 so here will be 535 and these questions you will do it by yourself by adding 1. Now this is so interesting question children write the number that comes between. So we have to write the between one number 319 and 321. So we, you will add 1 in 319 then also you can get and if you want to subtract 1 from 321 then also you will get the same answer that is 320 okay 500 and here 502 so you can add or subtract okay if you will add here 1 then also you will get 501 and if you will subtract 1 from here, then also you will get the same answer. Okay. 501. Here 751. And here 753. So what we will get here? 752. And these question you do it by yourself. Now turn the page number 20. Six, okay question number four write the predecessor and successor of the following numbers so numbers are here 811 599 700 455 308 and 261 so to get successor what we will do we have to add one okay 
and to get predecessor what we have to do we have to subtract 1 from 811 now we'll write it here like this 811 less 1 is equal to 810 so this is the predecessor and the number comes just before okay and what will be the successor we will write here 1811 plus 1 then we will get the answer that is 812 okay so here 599 so 599 we will write and we will subtract it from 1 and what answer we will get 598 okay and here we will add 599 plus 1 then we will get 600 okay so you I hope you all have understood it and do these questions by yourself.